What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel, or this is the first video that you're seeing, then welcome to my channel. And as you can tell from the title of this video, I'm going to be doing a nighttime routine. So my nighttime is pretty basic and simple. There's not a lot that goes into it. I don't have a ton of stuff like do right before I go to bed, so it's gonna be kind of a short video. Yes. In a minute. Move. Anyway, so let's just get into it. Okay, so this is a weird angle, but pretty much the next part of my evening routine is I am going to be washing some, doing some laundry. I have, it's probably best to start laundry early in the morning, but I'm a procrastinator and I don't do things until the very last minute. So I'm going to go ahead and wa wash some clothes and yeah. <laughs> It took me so long to turn the light on in the washing machine room, but yeah, I put the clothes in the washing machine, and now I'm going to probably grab a snack to eat. I have a whole chicken sandwich in the refrigerator, but I feel like it might be too late to eat that. Not really healthy, but then there's another part of me that doesn't care about that at all. I'm have to go eat my food. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm probably just going to grab some fruit. Cause I am trying to eat healthier. Also, stay tuned for my weight loss update coming sometime next week. So, yep, just a lot of stuff going on, and we have. See you guys in the bed. Okay, so quick update: the bathroom right next door. My brother's taking a bath. I don't know if you can hear anything or not, but I'm getting ready to work out right now. And normally I do that right before I go to bed. But long story short, I only ate half of my dinner, and so I'm hungry right now. But it's past 8 o'clock, so, like, eating a fried chicken sandwich is, like, really detrimental to, like, eat that this late. So, I heard that after you work out, you burn calories faster when you eat. So, I'm going to work out now and then eat my chicken sandwich before I take a shower. So, yeah. And my mom and my sister are in the living room, which is where I like to work out. So, that should be fun. But, Anyway, see you later. And I'm not going to show you guys the workout. I'll probably do another video where I'll show you my workout routine. But I'm not going to show you that right now because they're in the living room and they're going to laugh at me. But, yeah. Alright, so that's it. The workout is over and done with for the night. And I'm glad that I did the workout because it makes me feel just a little bit better. About the fact that it's almost 9 o'clock at night and I'm about to eat this. This is a chicken sandwich deluxe from Chick-fil-A. And I know I shouldn't be eating it, but I'm going to anyway, so there's that. So, we're just going to go ahead and get ready to have dinner and watch some YouTube, and then I'll probably check on my clothes and put those in the dryer, so, yeah. Alright, well, you guys, so I just finished eating my chicken sandwich, and it's 10 p.m. on the dot. I'm a slow eater, so I'm going to take my clothes out of the washing machine because I know they're done washing by now and just toss them in the dryer and then I'll be back. Okay, so I just took my um clothes out of the washing machine. I'm really out of breath, sorry. And I put them in the dryer, but I also ended up washing some rags and towels earlier today and they just got done drying. So I'm going to go ahead and fold those up and put those away and get on with the evening. Boom. Alright, so the moment of truth has finally arrived. I'm about to head into the shower. Alright, so I am, as you can tell, out of the shower and fully dressed. And it is now officially time for my nighttime face routine. And I don't know if you can tell, but I have really bad acne. And I also have really sensitive skin. So those two things kind of fight against each other. Because when I'm looking for products to help fight off my acne, I... You can't use most products because my skin is so sensitive to the point that even products that were made for sensitive skin, they bring my face out as well. So, I'm constantly trying different products and the one I've later started trying is the St. Ives Blackhead Clean Clearing Scrub. I think I said it right, so I turn it that way. So, this is what I've been using lately. Um, 
I guess it's kind of working a little bit. I'm kind of impatient, so I would like it to work a lot faster. But I've only been using it for like a week now. And you can only use it, it says, three to four times daily. So I use this every other night. I didn't use it last night, so I'm going to be using it tonight. So let's just get to it. it off because you're not supposed to let it like sit on your face so hmm. all right so now that my face is clean I'm going to brush my teeth my teeth I pretty much just put on some chapstick and then get ready for bed but before I fall asleep the very last thing I do is I read from the book that I'm currently doing reviews on the Moral Instruments series and so I like to read a couple chapters every night before I go to bed and tonight I'm actually finishing off this book City of Ashes. I'm going to be posting my review on it this coming Wednesday, so make sure you keep a lookout for that. Also, make sure you check out my last review for City of Bones, which came out on the 19th of June, so it's up on my channel. So make sure you go watch that, and yeah, I'm going to sit up and read, and then head off to bed, so... Thank you so much for watching this video. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you push the notification bell, you'll be notified every time I post a video. Thank you so much for all your love and support, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!